Peace be upon you all people. I hope you all are doing well. In this video, we'll get to know how to solve a 2 by 2 Rubik's Cube in under just 10 seconds. So let's begin. So first thing first, you cannot solve this cube just by using any tactics or any guesses. You need to imply an algorithm with notations. I'll show you the algorithm. But before beginning with that, I would like to show you some notations that will help you solve this cube. Consider first that the opposite of white is always yellow and for blue it's always green for orange it's always red in color so consider first we will consider first the right side which is this one so there is a notation called r r prime okay this is clockwise and this is anti clockwise similarly if you see on the left side this is called l if i am uh, rotating clockwise in right side direction then the left will be in anti-clockwise so if this is r r prime then l would be l l prime okay r r prime l l prime so this is right side and left side likewise we have top and bottom for top you could say top uh, take it as a t letter so this would be t t prime okay clockwise t t prime on the other side in the bottom if i am rotating clockwise t t prime then down d it would be d d prime clockwise anti clockwise now finally front side and back side so front you would call it as f and back side b which is this part this back side and this is the front side so if i am rotating clockwise this is f and this is f prime okay f f prime when you see on the back side this is b b prime if this is f f prime this will be b b prime so these are the algorithms you need to follow and I'll show you how to solve it in under 10 seconds. Let's begin. So before solving the cube, I will clear you with the notations first. We consider this as top T, T dash right. So instead of using T, we'll use it as U, like upper, upper, U, U dash, U, U dash. Okay, U clockwise, anti-clockwise, U, U dash. Now, if this is u u dash u u dash this would be bottom b b dash u u dash b b dash okay r r dash l l dash dash and prime are both same you could say prime or dash anything you like so for f f f dash okay f f dash and on back side b b dash f f dash b b dash okay u u dash b b dash r r dash l l dash so before solving the cube you need to solve the white first as you can see we can we have uh, white already solved here so we'll just jumble it okay before solving the cube the first thing is to solve the white which you can easily solve just by using your logical sense you just need to find a pair of white and then you need to find the third one just by using your what you say your logical sense you can easily solve bring the white here so third white is here so you need to bring this white here for bringing there you need to just bring it in the bottom layer here as it is in downside you need to bring it up that you could easily do just by using your logical sense which is very easy
so we got white here in order to bring this here you need to just just by using your logical sense turn it down here and that's it white is solved so after solving white you need to bring it down and focus on yellow as i said in the video first white opposite is yellow the most important thing is that you need to keep this yellow always on the left side so here for yellow you need to follow the notations okay r u r dash u r u to r dash okay whenever the yellow side comes it should be always on the back side and the white is wherever it should be now apply the same algorithm again r u r dash u r u to r dash see the white is still there again you need to keep this yellow always on the left side it should always be on the left side or on the back side if it is not in the left side it should be on back side okay same algorithm apply it again r u r prime u r u to r prime bring it on the left side again apply the same algorithm r u r dash u r u to r dash yellow is solved yellow is solved white is solved now you need to apply a third algorithm after solving the yellow and white you need to find a pair of two colors see here orange is one pair and green is also one pair here after finding that pair you need to keep it behind behind on the back side and on front side you need to apply this algorithm r prime f r prime b 2 r f dash or f prime r dash again b 2 and r 2 see you almost solved this upper layer now again as you solve this layer you need to find another color pair which is on the back side which is this one green you can find only one pair on the white side so you need to keep it on the back side always it should be always on the back it should not be left right or front apply the same algorithm again which is r prime f r prime b 2 that is 2 times and r and f prime r prime again b 2 and r 2 just flip it and here is your solve 2 by 2 rubik's cube this is very easy people solve it by you know just by any guesses or something you can solve one or two colors like that but in order to solve the whole cube you need to follow this algorithm because this is mathematics this is maths this is cube so without formula nothing will happen So that's it for today folks, children who are curious minded love to solve such cubes, share them this video and it will definitely help to build their cognitive ability, it will definitely help as an exercise to their brain and that's it and always peace.